In his address to the party congress, the general secretary spoke of sacrifices made and sacrifices yet to come. But he emphasized that there is no doubt that we are winning this war and that the end is in sight. It was a rout. Our scattered forces headed for Seattle and the relief we hoped we would find there. To use a nuclear bomb on one's own country, it, it was insanity on a scale unmatched even by our own generals. It also destroyed what dreams we had left of ever achieving victory in America. <laughs> if it hadn't been for the Colonel, we wouldn't have known about Cascade Falls at all. Based on the communiques from Moscow, all was as fine as could be. And now that the Chinese had declared themselves our allies, victory was supposedly within reach. Again. But we knew better. Yeah, so call one. The Americans are trying to surround us, but they will not succeed. They needed a nuclear bomb to stop our brave comrades at Cascade Falls. And they will need another one to stop us now. Oral 5, what is the status of the convoy? The wounded are in good shape and we are ready to continue forward. Good. Romanov, you will command our frontal aviation assets and protect the convoy. Ural 5 here, continuing ahead. Maloshenko will capture the radio relay station ahead and you must support him, Romanov. We can bring in reinforcements as soon as it is secure. Maloshenko to Sviazi, advancing at this time. Ural 5 here. I've ordered the convoy to continue north along the main highway. Excellent, we are moving. The Americans will not be able to hold us back. So call 1, out. This is Ural 5, we are moving out. Those trucks carry our infantry and our wounded Romano. Do your utmost to protect them. We're moving to the perimeter! Demarit Malashenko, we do not have time for this delay. We should leave the wounded to the Americans. I will not surrender our comrades to the enemy, Captain. But they will slow us down. As will you if you do not get a move on. Advance and secure the radio relay station as planned. Capture the relay station, securing the area now. Good. Make sure the radios remain functional. Of course, Colonel. Well, I shall go out.
the ambush. Moving at this time. Americans here. We will clear the surrounding area of enemy troops so that they don't surprise us again. Romano, use your helicopters to scout our flanks. Destroy all enemies you find. Maloshenko, report. Dovarit Maloshenko, the flanks are secure at the moment, but we will have a hard time getting to Seattle at this pace. The Americans are everywhere. Da. It's a fine mess we have landed ourselves in. Such dreams. Such a disaster. are moving more troops into the area. Destroy them, Romano. Commencing flyby attack. Heavy attack helicopter is inbound. Executing mission. should be counter-attacking. This covering about the countryside will lead us nowhere. Yet, Captain. To counter-attack now would be foolish and rash. We will follow the plan. Area clear. Move on to the next waypoint, Romano. Ural 5 here. We are moving at this time. It is uh, unfortunate that we didn't succeed at Cascade Falls. Things would have been different. Yeah, but not necessarily better, comrade. Maybe not. More enemy vehicles. Wipe them out, Lieutenant. Just keep us a command. Look and engage the enemy. Tank hunter away. They are blocking us. Target. Incoming artillery. Spreading out now. Short! Those artillery batteries must be dealt with. Romanov, I have a change of mission for you. You are to neutralize the American rocket launchers. We have their approximate locations marked for you. Armor moving out. Artillery ready. Got a route to route. Medium gunship flying to the coordinates. Ready. Moving to location. If they are attacking us, we're airborne. Heavy gunship will follow the flight path. Vertolet moving to location. Moving to location. They are attacking us! My 28 is engaging the enemy. Medium helicopter is in the air.
fine. The artillery barrage has stopped. We are regrouping. Well done, Lieutenant. But we still have much to do. The Americans have set up dug-in positions in and around the hills. These must be destroyed. We took out that hostile armor under attack. We have established contact with some fire support elements, Romanov. Call on them when needed. Communications intercept indicate an American command point to the north. Then we will destroy it as well. I should cripple them long enough for the convoy to escape. Duh. Then we can concentrate on the National Guard forces coming up from the south. Zural 5 here. Continuing ahead. Zural 5. We have several casualties from the barrage. This was unexpected. Try to protect what's left of the convoy, Romanov. Shouldn't we concentrate on moving forward? If we do so without clearing the area first, we will take heavy casualties. I protest this entire plan, sir. Noted. Now get moving. So call one. Out. have been cleared. Malashenko, are you in position? Malashenko, Slushin. We are ready. Bural 5 here. We are holding until further notice. We have incoming American fighters. They are warthogs. Take cover. their support to second company while they assault the command post. Just going away. We are engaged. You have yet to let me down, Romano. Don't do so now. Advance! And watch for stray enemies attacking the convoy, Romano. Protection of the trucks is still your main priority. Since the last call to rally at Seattle, we are getting sporadic transmissions from other battle groups, but nothing concrete. It's all falling apart. No! We will go to Seattle and let the Americans destroy themselves by attacking us! Yes, of course, Captain. Now secure that command post. It will soon be accomplished. Malashenko out. Yeah, 
We're with you. Armored transport heading out. We can roll out anytime. The British coming in. Where do you want us? Fire an 85 at that hostile. Area secure. Good. Ural 5, you are free to move ahead to the next rendezvous point. The road is clear. Acknowledge, Soko 1. See you there. Ural 5 out. This is Ural 5. We are moving out. We run the gauntlet with only minimal losses. Thank you for the excellent support, Comrade Lieutenant. APC here. What can you we protected do? the convoy and the wounded to the best of your abilities, Romano. Well done. Now we must see to defending our rear while the convoy continues on. I have a plan for how we will proceed. Briefing in five minutes. Captain Malashenko and Major Lebedev, you will attend. The rest of you hold in place and stand guard. If we go to Seattle, we'll die in Seattle. The Americans will never allow the Chinese to land. We saw in Cascade Falls how far they are willing to go. What exactly are you saying? We're not going to Seattle. I've made preparations to take the men home. A ship is expecting us at this location tonight. What? And betray our country? It's the right thing to do. I'll accept full responsibility. Were you aware of He's this? He's not in command here. I am. Please try to understand, Nikolai. I am Captain Maloshenko of the Soviet Army, and you are acting like a traitor. I'm doing this for the men, Kulia. Those men don't belong to you. They belong to the state. My wife and daughter didn't die so that you can turn tail and run. But we don't belong here. This entire venture has been a full... <laughs> Thank you, comrade. Thank you. He was a traitor. I'm taking my company to Seattle. I'll bring the battalion. To victory. To victory. Time to choose, old friend. To all Sokol elements, this is Major Lebedev. The Colonel is dead. I am taking command. Captain Maloshenko and 2nd Company has moved ahead to Seattle. We must organize the rear guard. Romanov, establish a perimeter and hold off all American attacks. You will have to command some of the ground elements as well, Romanov. Do not let the Americans through. Set up defensive positions by the highway. I uh, will see to the flanks. Frontal aviation will continue to fly sorties for us. Call them for air support. P2 is available. We're moving out now. Recovery vehicle available for repairs. Armor available for battle. APC will move now. Want us to repair something? Yes, the British coming. British coming near. Where do you want us? American ground forces approaching, and they have anti-air units. Be careful, Romano. Switching communications to alternate frequency 4. Do so 
Now. Ural 5, acknowledge. Ural 5 here. Ural 5, you have new orders. The convoy is to proceed to the coordinates I'm about to send you. We will fight off the Americans here and then follow you. Understood. Maloshenko, acknowledge. This is Lebedev, calling Captain Maloshenko. Prion. They must have missed the frequency switch. Too bad, but we will manage without them. We are engaged. I will clear the sky. the Romanov. Recovery vehicle. Yes, Tvarishka, we cannot do that. I didn't spot any enemies at the provided coordinates. Out. Keep us the armor moving out. Our strikes are rolling. Tvarishka, we need. We have three MP2. Armor, 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 APC will move. Our tracks are steady. Tvarishka, we need. We must resist them with all we have. This is it, Ramana. We will break their attack and then retreat. Armor here. Armor moving out. Assault that perimeter. Heavy gun. Affirmative. Flying to the goal. Armor available for battle. Where is coming here? We're with you. Get that perimeter. Run. 
are giving up. I can see why the Colonel put so much trust in you, Comrade Romano. You have saved all our lives here today. This is Major Lebedev to all remaining units. The time has come for us to retreat. We will not go to Seattle, but to an industrial harbor further north where a transport ship is waiting to take us home. This order comes directly from Army Command. Captain Maloshenko and 2nd Company will not be joining us. The Americans have a saying, live to fight another day. And that is exactly what we will do, comrades. And then we will honor the colonel's memory by winning this war. Lebedev out.
they say you're asking me for papers. I'm sorry, Comrade Major, but since Colonel Arlovsky's dead, Capt I can't Captain, without Captain, do you know who Comrade Minister Kravchenko is? Divryadna. Of course. He is the Minister of Defense. And my father-in-law. Do this, and I'll make sure you're duly rewarded for your selfless service to the state. Major, without some confirmation, I simply can And then can't... again, I could just have my men shoot you. Perhaps your second in command is more willing to listen. We'll leave with the tide. Good choice. Tell the men 